You're watching RVT Rashid's Teletube, serving nations worldwide. Up uh, next on RVT, Rashid's Video Tube, the Rashid YouTube Radio Show. Keep one foot firm on the ground and the other one in happiness as we all celebrate shyst in this season. Here on RVT, where's Rashid all the time. RVT want to wish you a very happy shyston season. You're watching RVT, Rashid's Teletoon Worldwide. Where is Rashid all the time? Go watch it, RVT, Rashid's Teletoon, serving nations worldwide.
You're watching RVT, Rashid's Teletoon Worldwide. Where is Rashid all the time? You're watching Rashi's RVT. Still looking around the internet. Still searching. Find what you're looking for. My people always stop right here because this is where Sadisians live. RVT, Rashid's video tube. Can you feel that? I'm sure you can. It's liquidation's blowout at Factory Free! Authentic finishes incorporated. Custom screen printing special. Come in and get comfortable and take advantage of warehouse sales 80% off on well, some dealers. So come in, they're waiting to help and greet you. Come where you can see you can take advantage of everything. Gift ideas, shoe ideas, and much, much more. All at the Factory Free! Check the warehouse self up to 70% off. That's right, 70% off. That's what the food coupons where you can save that the kids will love. That's the premium retail group. Mega warehouse sale. 60 to 90% off. More offers. 30, 20, 50, 40% off. Save, save, save. That's customary items or close up. It's worth the wait. All fire on Friday and Sunday, coat and remedy, you can't go wrong. 30% off, 20% off, and $25 for cosplay. In some dealers, commercial moving and offers relocation may apply. Brought to you by RVT, so take advantage and save. Plus toys for the toddlers. Buy one, get one free for one dollar. Just buy one, get one free for one dollar. Hey, that picture looks familiar there. No offense, boss, but we had to show him. Uh, honey, could you come in for a second? Going, 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 gone. Check www.svn-bid2win.com. That's www.svn-bid2win.com. Check out the Capital Options Warehouse Sale also. Hi, this is Rashi, President and CEO of RVT. Come in and save. Check for warehouse prices for great savings. You'll be glad you did. That's right! And with warehouse storage, you can't go wrong! So come in and save at Factory Warehouse Sales and Rajin approves at Factory Freight! Oh, 
catchy, singing all your favorite hits. Come sing along with Rashid. R M J C, the R man. Groove it up. The voice of Rashid singing all the time on social media, thanks to YouTube and Google Club. not for political gain nor is it for profit but the one thing that it is for the world has long forgotten and that's friendship RVT Rashid's video tube serving nations worldwide You're watching RVT, Rashid's video too. Home of Rashid's universe. Hey, Cindy, what's this uh, snake here doing in our picnic? And what is more, what is doing uh, announcing the Rashid universe thing there? Hey, did you hear me? What you doing here? Hey guys, it's me, Rashid. Listen, um, I'm gonna take this time out right now just to remind you guys that the Rashid YouTube radio show is coming up soon. <laughs> um, I have to put it on schedule, but I'm still around. <laughs> what was that? Still want to laugh, still want to joke, still want to have fun, do you? <laughs> now you guys know we got this down tight. <laughs> so join me right here on RBT. Oh, we like you. For my see YouTube radio show. Um, check Rashid's Google Plus which you're on right now or YouTube for time and schedule. I will keep you posted, man. You know that. You know how we do it. See you later, guys.
I'm like out of my way, but fuck Rashid and lost his fucking mind. Quick guys, run for the hills! Ah! Everybody run! Everybody run! Ah! Look out! RVT. Rest, rest, play. Remember, any physical activity requires hours of rest, so be sure and get yours. Or if you need help with sleeping problems, just go to www.needhelptosleep.org. That's www.needhelptosleep.org. You're watching RVT, Rashid's Teletoon Worldwide. Where is Rashid all the time? When I think about how much I love and one chocolate, oh. Just a reminder, it's always time for chocolate. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? What's up? What's up? What's up? The sky, the sky, the sky. The ceiling, the ceiling, the ceilings. What's up? It's the Armin coming at you live. What's happening, dudes? What it be like? What it's like? And fuck that fucking shit around here. First of the month. Happy shyster. Welcome to RVT. Guys, I'm going to tell you the truth, man. You know? Motherfucker going through it. Alright? I'm letting y'all know that. I'm going through that fucking shit. I'm going through the fucking shit. Dude. And... Uh, Y'all gotta realize I'm gonna do what I can, when I can, you know? Cause, you know. Treasure, the, tower, the, the fuck is this? 
Okay. Uh, Alright. Okay. Uh, wait a second. With that fucking shit. That fucking thing. Little white kids and shit. Here you go with the fucking talking shit. Blowing out your fucking the squeaky voice fucking shit all around me. The white kids thing. The squeaky voice shit all around. That's why white man crazy today. Anyway. Guys, welcome to RVT. Um, I have I have a treat, okay. But the treat this um that I have is like you gotta wait for it because I'm still working on it. Y'all can be patient. Y'all can understand, right? So I'm watching this movie. I just got it on. I think I'm gonna leave it on. Why I uh talk to you guys all through it. I don't fucking know. I, I should really... I'm trying to... I don't even know what I... I just want to talk and I don't know if, if I... If, like... How can I fucking say this? I'm trying to put up something. You know how you watch something while you listen to me talk? I don't know what to put up on a fucking screen, dude. So whatever y'all looking at is what I decided to put up, dude. I'm just talking. I don't give a shit. I'm in the middle of so much. I'm reconstructing something that I think you guys really gonna like it. You know, and but you guys have to give me patience. I have the Rashi YouTube Radio Show coming up, but you have to understand. Let me let me turn this down so I can explain to you guys. You have to understand about that is that the months didn't add up with me. You know, I'm I'm on a tight schedule, guys. You know, this is not all I have. So, the months didn't add up this month and last month. So, it put me... It's like I'm put behind, but I'm not put behind. Because I try to get up like a video a week or two videos a week. Sometimes I go ballistic. Y'all know I just keep posting and shit. It all depends on how I feel. But something like the Rashi YouTube Radio Show, I have to wait to... All our responsibilities around my commune is complete. Like I had the first of the month. I had to take care of bills and I took care of bills and all the bullshit like that then. Now I gotta go food shopping. I wanna make sure all my shit is out the way before I launch something like the Rashi YouTube radio show. That's just the way we do things around here. We don't enjoy things unless work is done first. You understand? So... It, it seemed like a really long time, and it maybe has been a long time since I last posted. But y'all have to understand that I'm doing a lot of things here. I'm doing the best I can. You know, even when I can't put up no RVT, I still come on and, and put up a post, or y'all can try my blog page, or, or something going on. I just don't leave you hanging. Y'all know that. But as far as this go, y'all have to be patient, because... I'm in the middle of a lot of other things. Putting it together is no problem. It's just sitting here doing this right here. Talking. <laughs> it's because it's just, I'm so fucking busy, dude. I don't mind doing it. I'm not going to stop doing it. It's just, I am just need y'all to understand the reason why um, it's like, it's lingering. But it's not really lingering, guys. It's, it's really not. It's just that shit just fucking up on me at the wrong times, you know. I have to go shopping. I'll do that in the middle of next week if I can. And when this test all over, hopefully by next week it will have some RV t um, Rashi YouTube radio show up. But you guys got to be patient. Because like I told you, when you don't see me. I'm going to do what I can to entertain you guys. I'm going to do what I can. Please forgive me if you get upset. You come, I know it's a pain in the ass. You got to keep coming to my channels, checking to see if I did something. Over all throughout the day. You coming to my channel, let me see if he did something over I know it's a pain in the ass for you. I'm go I got that in mind. I don't like y'all doing that. Okay. Because I'm thinking about making a chart that y'all could just come one place and see if I got something posted somewhere. And y'all could just go there. Rather than y'all coming here, checking here, checking here, and then leaving, coming back, checking. I want to stop all of that. I don't like y'all going through that shit. So I think I'm going to make up um, like a, 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 a something that's going to be just on my page. That y'all going to know automatically if I put something up or not. To go to my blog or go to my community or so forth. I think that will be better for you. So I think I'm going to do that. But I can't do it right now, guys. Y'all got to relax and, 
and give me a, give me a chance to fucking breathe. Dude. You know, I'm doing so fucking much. It's my commune. It's what we believe and so forth. And now I got to come on and do RBT for you guys. And it's like, well, damn, when do I get, when do I get my dick sucked? You see what I'm saying? When do I get me a fucking blowjob? It's like that, dude. Like, when do I get my dick sucked? When do I get, you know, when do I get little girls going between my toes and shit? You know, y'all, y'all, you know, y'all gotta understand. I'm not these motherfuckers in Hollywood. Ain't nobody writing me. Now, that's the flip side of shit. Ain't nobody writing me no fucking check, dude. So, it ain't fucking like that. It ain't baking without the bread around this motherfucker. You know it. Oh, you only get that shit on Thurry Montgomery. You don't get that shit around here. So, right off the bat, all that freebie bullshit. That's, that's, ain't nobody giving a motherfucker a thing, dude. That's what I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying to step to you streetwise, like a motherfucker, like, you know, ain't nobody giving me a fucking dime, ain't nobody writing me no fucking check around here, so, I, I don't know what the Don, everybody Don Knotts in for, I really don't fucking know, you can act like Don Knotts all you want, but ain't nobody writing me no fucking check, so, theoretically, y'all gotta wait, alright, I ain't on no fucking CBS, NBC, Hundred million dollar checks every fucking two weeks. I ain't got. I ain't like them fuckers on CNN. All right, y'all balling with a poor motherfucker here. So y'all gotta understand. Hey, I ain't got the enthusiasm of like that Jimmy Cartel faggot, the Roman Rob, whatever the fucking night shows they fucking got now. These fuckers here who automatically do go and just be on the air on working because they paying them up. Like, if this man gave you $10,000 a show, you'll fucking work your balls off too. You dig what I'm saying? There ain't no cartel bullshit around this motherfucker is what I'm saying. Ain't no CBS motherfucker around here. Ain't no light show down Leno, Leno's and fuck. Ain't shit around here. So directly fuckers gotta wait. And that's just the way it go now. I'm gonna tell you what's I'm gonna talk to you this real. Alright, so ain't nobody writing no checks. Ain't no Linos and fucking Harvey Cartels and Jimmies around this motherfucker getting thousand dollar checks and shit. So, chill the fuck out and wait. That's the fucking deal right there. Everything else is everything else is Cheerios in the morning time. Don't never forget that. Everything else is Cheerios in the morning time. So don't fuck around. Ain't nobody paying a motherfucker. So wait. That's the flip side of shit. Any way you want to take it, just take it. I have something up, dude. The fuck? Let me start this nut movie. What is this, a nut movie? What is it called, this shit? The Nun's Paradise or some shit? The Nun Killer. The Killer Nun? So how y'all been, man? Y'all miss me? Y'all miss the fuck out of me. No. I would have been on something, man. You know, because that's how I go out around here. I don't give a fuck about the bullshit. I never gave a fuck about the bullshit, dude. I know. I got some awesome shit coming up for you guys. Y'all gonna have to wait. I'm just putting this up now for something y'all to look at because y'all about to go crazy, man. Y'all about to go crazy. I feel you. I fucking feel you, guy. I miss you, too. I fucking miss y'all too, but y'all gotta stay. Daddy be busy. Daddy be busy, man. Uh, I'm not gonna fucking stop shit. I'm just saying, you know. I don't even know what the fuck to call this, this fucking shit. I know it's RVT. I know what the fuck RVT is, shit, but. I don't know what the, I don't know what the, ain't nothing more sexy than a Jewish nun, dude. I get a Jew, I get a Jewish nun pregnant. There's no way I won't get a Jewish nun pregnant. There's no fucking way. They pretty as a motherfucker, cause they get dressed in a all white nun uniform, they nose stick out like a, that's some sexy ass shit to me. I get that. I nod her up. I nod her right the fuck up. Her father be looking for me. This motherfucker got you pregnant. I nod her right up, right the fuck up. A Jew nun. I nod her up. Father Bishop. 
No, if I no, no way, if I was a deacon, I not I not that bitch up. She said, "Pretty Jewish women, some pretty ass mice looking women." That's how I understand them fuckers do fucking uh, that's Channel Twelve Hitler shit. They so full of shit. We saw this shit. We saw this shit before. Anyway, yo, um, I miss you guys too. We gonna hang out for a bit. We keep y'all satisfied. I'm gonna keep y'all fucking satisfied too. I yo. Uh, Yo, my fucking people, and I'm going to look after you, because we all we got. Y'all see that shit, right? Y'all ain't, ain't fucking stupid. Everything I'm saying, y'all going out in the world and experiencing what I see you, right? That's why I ain't worried about it. I know you are. I know y'all sit back and watch everything you talk about. You be on point with I know I ain't even going to fucking go into it. I know what the fuck going on, dude. That's why y'all around me right now. I want to hear my voice. Because you know I am you know I give a fuck about you when I first came on. I told you that shit. And all these YMCA motherfuckers. And all these counselors and shit. And I told that bitch. Imagine her jerking off. Because that's all the fuck she doing. I'm pretending like they caring about somebody bullshit. And the, the child, they only give a fuck about it. They tell her. They still tell these kids any fucking thing. The world is going to shit, dude. Fuck it, dude. All this shit fucking up, and they still got black man on the front daily news and shit. Some stupid ass shit like that. So I ain't got time for that fucking shit like that. All these fucking problems, and you wake, wake up in the morning, or they still fucking with niggas and shit. What the fuck is wrong with these assholes? You know, I ain't got time for none of this shit. I ain't got, I, I don't even want to think about that. All the problems in the world, you waking up looking at the paper, looking at a goddamn a, a stupid ass nigga doing something stupid or whatever. Why are you even fucking with them anyway? All these fucking problems. This is stupid ass shit like that. See, that's what I'm talking about. I ain't, I ain't got nothing to do with none of that shit no more, man. He trying to get some pussy. That doctor right there trying to fuck that nut. That's the end. Look at Doogie Hauser and shit. <laughs> look, at Do look at Doogie Hauser. <laughs> now this 1978. Hey, all you don't fucking look like a Doogie fucking Hauser and fuck. I am so glad that the warm weather is coming in, dude. I swear to God. I am so glad that the warm weather is coming in, fuck you, man. I swear to God. I'm not shit, you dude. All that fucking cold weather. And I've been locked in a fucking one room with my people. That shit was up the ass. That shit was Vaseline up the fucking scrotum. That shit was some suffering ass shit. I was mad as a motherfucker, man. Because I'm trapped in that fucking room and shit. And it's cold and my heater busted. And it's like, I don't believe this fucking... Now I can get my um, YouTube radio show uh, started again because my shit was frozen the fuck up. So everything matching up. You guys just got to be patient. This nut great kill this chink. I don't fuck it. Oh yeah, yeah, she I think she gonna kill him too. She gonna kill that chink ass motherfucker. She gonna kill him. You know why? Cause Pearl Harbor, that's the fuck why. <laughs> gonna kill that fucking goop. <laughs> nah, that, that she ain't that she ain't doctor stop. Ain't nothing like 1970s, 1960s movies. I can't go with that new shit. Oh, about that fucking, um, comic book uh, movie thing. What is it? The, um, 
What is, what is the name of it? That comic book movie that just uh, the fuck came out. Utility, utilities and some shit. The the unity fucking. The ex. What was it? What the fuck? Is, no, I will all do respect. I'm trying to think of that movie. Marvel. It was the. Uh, some utilities and some shit. I forgot the fuck. But. Yeah, they ain't do too well. All that, all that fucking bullshit. And then I heard it didn't. It did well at the box office, of course. That, but they say the movie outline period wasn't that good after all. You know, so I figured, well, you know, y'all some choosy ass sons of bitches. You know, my credible hawk getting some pussy. I ain't going for that shit anyway, dude. So you can say what the fuck you want to say. He was getting pussy ever since he was fucking that bitch with the green hair. And I don't know how they start giving Incredible Hulk some pussy, dude. He don't fuck. Who nothing? When it's time to bust a nut, who busting a nut? David Banner or the Hulk? Stupid ass shit right there. How the Hulk will get some pussy? And they and David Banner will get some pussy and shit. The Hulk in love with the girl with the green hair and shit. Does she have the green hair on the fucking, uh... That's what I fucked. I fucking lost interest in that long. Then you got Batman beating Superman. How the fuck Batman beat some damn Super? So I don't give a shit. So I knew it was gonna be. Do I? I don't even want to fucking talk about that fuck. I'm I'm in it, but I'm not in it like you guys, like some of you guys. Are in it. I'm in it though, but not like y'all. Y'all, y'all in it. I tell you, I got off that shit. I got off that shit ever since. Uh, they start fighting each other. Every since the comics, they start, hey, it's cool for Superman to fight Aquaman and shit. Like, that's when I got off the shit. So we talking, when they start hitting, they're going back in 90, early 90s. The early 90s, dude. That's when they started that shit for Toronto. Because I was married, and I was into the comics. And I remember slowing down because they started that shit up. But I was married back then. But it was cool to see them fight each other instead of fighting villains and shit. That's when I left the fucking thing. But so I'm not really into it, into it, but I got my eye on it. And Hulk getting pussy, dude. I don't understand that. That's some fucked up ass shit. Half these comic motherfuckers, are, oh, they still alive though. That guy's still alive. Everybody sucking his dick. He could get a white boy to suck his dick, dude. That guy uh, from the Marvel. Who's responsible? I forgot his name. Old oh, man with glasses. He, you know, he could get any white boy to suck his dick. They worship his ass. That's that's one smooth ass white man. I swear to God, that that fucker right there. Who I'm talking? They just did a commercial on YouTube about this motherfucker, and they was advertising that um, Avengers: Days of Ultra. That's what that's what it, that's what the fucking was. Avengers: Days of Ultra. And he, he was in a commercial with a bunch of celebrities and shit. The guy uh, who... And, and I always knew it, though. They, they kiss his... White boys kiss... They could, they, he, could go, he could get a blowjob from a white boy like it ain't shit. They worship his ass like he God. He a comic book God, dude. So... And he's cool as shit when you see him. He looks... He talks cool. He acts cool. He like... Hey, this one guy, he looks like, you know... He all this, he invented this and this, but he looks like, uh, yeah, he a cool motherfucker, man. The white boys hold him up as God. They could, he could get one of the white boys that suck his scrotum any fucking time of the day. They'll do that shit. Because he invented Spider-Man. I swear to God, I ain't fucking with you. That's white power right there when you look at that fucker. And the Jew man ain't far behind him. That fucker, that. I always said, dude, always said, he could get a white boy to suck his dick like it ain't shit. There's so much power that fucker got. He be like, when I invented the uh, Spider-Man, this is what I had in mind. I had in mind, he, be, he still got it. He's, he's still trucking and shit. No white boys that suck his dick. His dad lick his asshole if he told him to. Yeah, he a white god. 
I wanted to bring out the best in the character. If it ain't the best, then it's not the baby like that. He be breaking shit down about Aquaman and every fucking thing. This motherfucker. White boys are sucking, cleaning shit on his fucking ass. <laughs> Nerd ass motherfuckers. <laughs> He the you have to know white boys and shit. That's who the fuck he is. <laughs> you have to got the white women. That, that motherfucker got the white men. He the you have to know white men. He is a cool boy. That's the bit of a fucker. Spider Man, he's still here? You honor that son of a bitch. Or oh, Hawk, he invented the Rangers. I never thought about that. He ain't been in. I don't think he did Spider. I think he did know the Iron Man and fucking shit. He ain't been in some fucking body. And he's the man right now. So what's going on with you guys, man? Y'all miss me and everything. Y'all miss hearing my voice. Y'all stuck to me, dude. You stuck to me like fucking... Some of y'all stuck to me worse than my cum dribbling down the side of my dick. And it's like, I don't even fucking know what I'm doing to make y'all this way. It's fucking crazy. I just don't understand. I'm not doing any fucking thing. What happened to that black guy? That fucking, uh... He got a black, a brother... Setting himself on fire, a torch man on Fantastic Four. The the torch guy is gonna be a black guy. Ooh, with that fucking thing. I said that was real. That 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 motherfucker uh, go and turn, start fighting on every fucking one of them and rule and say I'm take doing what I want to do. That was a real fucking brother. Any fucking way. These old seven up niggas they got on these fucking movies and shit. Oh seven, you know seven up niggas and shit. <laughs> seven up niggas. Hey, this is me for seven up and shit. They got these seven up niggas playing these superhero roles and shit. That ain't even my business. I don't even give a fuck about it, dude. I don't even give a shit. I really don't. Go up with your seven up niggas, dude. Where's the where's the next one at anyway? He's been due. He's but he's been due for a while. The other the other poppy eye goldfish nigga went to Hollywood or something, right? He went to Mad TV or some shit. SNL. He went he went some fucker with. All right, where's the next one at? Take your taking a long fucking time. Get another motherfucker up there for that seven up soda and shut the do your fucking thing. These seven up niggas playing the Hollywood movies thinking they balling and shit. That's some crazy ass shit, man. So I don't know, I want to come on and just let y'all know I'm on live, man, and I know you're alive, and I'm alive, I'm just, I'm just going through, I'm just trying to do every fucking thing, dude. it's the first of the month, around, oh yeah, I want to say around the first of the month, dude, don't expect much around here, I mean that fucking thing, I might as well tell you now, because this ain't working, alright? This ain't working. Near the middle, near the end of the month, RVT is bumping. We all know that. But then the first of the month, we always go through this right here. All right. I'll make an announcement. Around the first of the month, it slows up around here. All right. Let's get there right off the bat, guys. And I'm dead serious because I'm not going through this shit again. Like I'm obligated to stay the same as I was the rest of the month. No, first of the month, we do shit around here, dude. So... Y'all that fucking thing I, I, look, y'all always know the first of the month it gets slow around RVT. Now make now don't forget. Now I'm telling you, don't forget. I ain't forget about you, dude. I see if we go down with each other. I ain't gonna forget about you. I don't know why you you so stuck up on you know relax, dude. 
Relax, man. Watching this fucking nun and shit. She did some crazy ass shit. I don't think I'm gonna put up the beginning of this movie. It says killing none on your screen. Alright, that that's what the fuck uh That's what y'all that's what I chose. Cause I'm gonna put that up here. Cause I don't know what to put up here for you. I really know. I'm sitting here bombing, dude. I'm fucking bombing my fucking ass off. Right the fuck, I don't give a shit. I'm making I'm always working, I'm doing some awesome things, but I just can't you know, come on and do. I I figured the Rashi YouTube Radio Show is next, correct? Okay, the Rashi YouTube Radio Show is next. I will have that up. I have to go full shopping first, which is next week. About next week, I'll go next week. I wanted to get that done and then put up. The, I didn't want nothing to be here right now. You see. But y'all not being patient. I'm feeling y'all. I'm getting up with me. I'm starting to wait on my Gmails and shit. That's when y'all acting crazy and shit. And I'm like, I'm not getting, um. What the fuck am I talking about? I'm not getting, uh, some shit. I don't fuck it. I'm not getting, um. You know, I'm just getting crazy shit. So I know to hurry up and put something up because y'all like babies. If y'all don't get RVT, y'all ain't crazy. So, I had to just go, but I didn't want to put nothing up. I just wanted to stretch over the next week, dude. But I know y'all ain't gonna last. I know y'all ain't fucking last. <clears throat> you know, y'all wanna hear y'all dad. And I'm obligated to give you me. You know, I'm a celebrity and everything. And I do appreciate y'all liking me. Because I like you just as much. You know, whether you know it or not. Believe it or not. I do. I'm trying to take your anger every chance I get. Because we all gotta get along here and survive this bullshit. All right, enough is enough. The signing papers, the talking, I'm going to do, I'm going to do, watch, wait, wait and see, watch. All this, I'm going to do, boy, I don't like that shit no more. All right, around here, we quit. Now we ain't got to do shit. How about that? Now we ain't got to think about shit. Now we ain't got to, nothing. But what we want to fucking do. How about that for now? Or, or have to do. And stay within laws and do it. And that's what we're about around here. We're not for that, uh, that, that ordinary kind of shit no more. We quit. We gave up on that. It don't work, dude. It don't work. This is over to us. Do we believe that this is over? We see it every day. And um, ain't nothing nobody can say to justify any fucking thing I talk about. This shit is over. Ain't no way mankind cleaning up after this shit. If he do, it will be a historical thing that mankind, that civilization took a reverse turn. That never happened before in history, dude. And this motherfucker look at me like I'm a dickhead now if I act normal. I know it's fucking over. Personally, I know it's over. I'm a, I'm fucking a dickhead. Why have I she got to be a sucker because I'm nice, dude? Oh, it's over, dude. There's no fucking way, personally, I do not know that it's over. It's over. I'm this, I'm this, I'm this, and I'm, I'm the only thing I'm dishing out is friendship to you guys. And you hating me like this. It's over. See, I got it personally, biblically, all the fuck around. How the fuck you gonna hate some damn Rashid, dude? I can't figure that out. To this very, I can't, fr how the fuck? Can you hate some damn Rashid, man? How the fuck? You know? How the fuck? I don't do nothing. Dude, I'm just trying. From day one, I'm trying to reach out to you guys. I ain't gonna go through the fucking shit, but I'm just saying. You see the point? So I know it's fucking over. I know it's over. I don't give a fuck about it anyway. I don't give a fuck about it. I'm 40 fucking five years old. Why the fuck should I give a fuck about it? I'm out this bitch doing any damn way. Fuck this place. Why the fuck it in a handbag? I don't give a fuck about me growing old. I don't give because when I was younger, I was making old people feel good. Now I'm growing old, my fucking self. 
shit. I'm going out. I told you I'm going out there like a Rockefeller. That's how I'm going out. Oh, I'm going out like a Donald Trump or some shit. Right in the trash. A regular old heat cliff in garbage cans. Girl. What is this, sweetie? What is it? What is it now? What are you trying to tell? Okay. Let me let her out. Get her out. So, I'm a regular old Heathcliff in a trash can thinking I'm a Rockefeller. Thinking I'm Bob of Water or some fucking shit. RVT, I think I'm fucking Jim Rand or some fucking thing. That's how I fuck I'm going out. Just like this. Like that fucker on that missile going down and you screaming and hollering. Y'all see Rashid Day, Rashid, y'all some stupid sons of bitches, dude. It's an old movie, classic movie. This guy on a missile falling down to the ground screaming and hollering. If they ain't me right now. Dude, I give up. That's why all y'all fuckers listening to me. Like, this is somebody who really gave up. Y'all looking at Rashid like, this is somebody who really know. Y'all know exactly what the fuck I'm talking about. Don't try to play stupid, guys. Y'all know exactly what the fuck I'm talking about. Y'all know what I'm talking about. And y'all know if anybody do this shit, they did. You know that fucking thing. All right, I'm thinking that missile motherfucker. Now, fuck all y'all. I'm like, that. I don't give a shit no more. I give up. I gave too much, I can't give no fucking more. Only thing I can give now is love, dude. And I'm going to do it. What i always been deprived of, I'm going to do it. And that's give love to my fellow man. And that's what I'm going to do. Because, see, that wins. And you think you're looking like a sucker, but you ain't looking like no sucker, dude. No, you ain't looking like no sucker. You see a bright something in front of you. Because that's an identifying mark of a true Christian. And that's how I, if the Jesus said that's more than any other law, how important is that? And he says, I'm the light of the world. So when you give then, you will stand out. You will look like a sucker, but think you're not really looking like a sucker. Dude. You're looking like a regular human being. And that's something the world has never seen in a long fucking time. I don't give a fuck what you did. I don't give a fuck how much you made shit. I don't give a fuck. The world have not seen it. Somebody standing up and says, I love my fellow man. I want to do what's right. And I don't agree with this bullshit. That's a real human being. And we're taught that we'll get hurt if we do that. And others have got hurt because they did it. All I'm saying is one more time. Let's spend this one more fucking time, dude. Just one more time in the United States of America in every way one more time that's all I'm asking one more time now I'm that y'all see what I'm about alright don't play the nut roll let's everybody get the work one more time dude that's all I'm asking I ain't asking for much okay let's just see what happens because see things are getting out of hand here to the point if we don't do something about it you know, we're in trouble here. Nobody cares. I'm not dying for no fucking body, dude. I'm not dying for nobody. I'm sorry. I don't go out that way. Now, we're going to get ourselves together and know that I'm your buddy. And you're going to know that. And let's cut the shit around here. All right? We got problems here. And it's the little bullshit things I talk about is foundation for all the stupid shit that y'all think is important, which I don't. I know it's not important shit. That's why I don't give a fuck about it. It's the bullshit that I give a fuck about that started your shit that you claim is the real problems. Trust me on that, dude. Trust me. And I will keep talking about the, the bullshit. Because once your ass go out there on your own, you know I'm knocking the fuck out of you. You know I am. Of course, it's bullshit when you read the motherfucker. 
But then when you go out there in the world and remember what I said, I'm knocking you upside your fucking head and you fucking know it. That's the point I'm trying to make to you. Stay on the same level and let's do this shit. Because this is bullshit. And y'all guys know out there know who I'm talking about, what kind of person I'm talking about. This lady getting fucked on the screen while I'm... This white bitch getting fucked on my goddamn screen while I'm talking to you guys. And I don't know. My dick gonna get hard now. Yup. I felt moving in my dick. See how quick I get erection, dude? I'm still a sex fiend, but I'm learning how to deal with it. Yeah, my dick getting hard. I swear to God. I just heard... I ain't even paying a bitch no attention. And I'm getting erect right now. Because I knew she had a sex on the screen. <laughs> Yeah, I'm pretty, uh, I got a very strong sex drive, man. Very strong. It's going down there. <laughs> you ain't got shit going down. I ain't even paying this shit no attention. I'm getting fucking hard. Listen, I'm one of them type, man. I'm getting hard in the fucking. I'm fucking like an engine, dude. I got a big gas thing. I'm, a, I'm really equipped for sex. I, I, I'm a dick, you know, I like. I just like it. I just fucking like sex. I like to feel it stimulated. I like that. I like that feeling. I like it. If I could do it all day and feel like that all day, you fucking man. I used to jerk off all day. I used to. I don't no more, but... I like to feel sexually stimulated. I do. I like it. Y'all don't. Some of y'all don't. I, y'all keep like, oh, it feels funny down there. <laughs> I laugh at you fuck. Cause y'all, y'all don't, y'all don't feel it, y'all don't, you know what I'm saying, y'all feels funny, oh, is that feeling, I know what to do, yeah, <laughs> yeah, y'all motherfuckers, <laughs> I laugh at y'all, y'all be like that, but all feels funny and shit, yeah, it does feel funny down there, you're right, it feels funny down there, that feeling right there, you just to feel that thing. You ain't supposed to feel in this country. You ain't supposed to feel. If you feel that thing and you ain't got permission, oh my God. You go out there going, how dare you feel like they're thinking they eat all that fucking thing. But you go go over there and knock somebody upside the fucking head. Yeah, that's what I'm about to say. You go, you go knock somebody upside the fucking head and God, you just a regular dude on the street, huh? That's how it works. Wow, all they got, all the motherfuckers got who just want to go up and bash somebody on the fucking head. Oh, they just normal people that got attitude problems in the city. That's all. They just normal. That's all. That's what they got. And motherfuckers like me got all this fucking bullshit. Okay. All right. We'll see about that. Okay. We'll see about that. We're going to do a little switch of rules here. I like to fuck. I like the feeling of being stimulated. I like getting erections, rock hard, juicy erections, and letting it sit there until I bust a nut. I like doing that. I like, uh, if I could jerk off every day, I'd jerk off. Now, what are you going to do now? Since it's okay for a motherfucker to say, I want to go up and bust my side of the fucking head and knock his fucking teeth off, and that's okay. But when I say my shit, I'm a fucking what? Why? What was this fucking thing? I let a bitch sit on my fucking face in a heartbeat if she pretty enough. And she could cake up the fuck right there. And I do mean cake the fuck up. Now, what about that? Okay, you think about it. Tell me what the fuck the, the loo. And don't tell me what the fuck they're like in this goddamn fucking shit. Do what the fuck I like when I motherfuck. That's what people die for my rights. So I can feel this way. Y'all not going to take them from me. Y'all try it with each other. Try it with family members. You ain't supposed to say that. You ain't supposed to, but if it's not in the United States laws, there's nothing wrong with it. And don't take away my fucking rights. That's the way I feel about it. That's the way I feel about it. You don't like it? Go watch that video game front page. I don't know what the fuck is on their fucking mind. The front page newspaper, whatever they do. Rubik's Cube answer how many sneezes? What does it mean? 
How many times I can go to sleep? I ain't gonna talk about no top tens, cause top tens are my shit. I like top tens, but you know, I'm talking about how long does it take the butterfly to hatch? Y'all go to that fucking education bullshit, dude. But don't bring that bullshit the fuck around here. Dude. That's all I'm asking. All right, just like Peter and Pan go together. Peter Pan, just like Peter and fucking Pan do. Don't bring that PBS, Barney, Snoopy, whatever the fuck, Elmo shit the fuck around here. You know, how many sneezes you gotta take? Uh, we discovered a new bug to help you lose weight. Don't bring that PBS fucking Alpha Hitchcock bullshit the fuck around here. And that motherfucker, man. I mean that fucking thing. But that's fucking some St. Elsewhere fire, St. Elmo's fire bullshit. They on, on the fucking mainstream social media shit, talking that bullshit. They on some fucking, I mean, I don't know what the fuck going on there. But don't bring that shit around here, I'm fucking me. Because them motherfuckers could be any, I don't know what the, how the fuck. So, in a nutshell, man, this is the suck. So, I like you guys. Let me talk to y'all. Y'all like my sheet because why? I don't fucking know. I like you guys because you guys are human and people. If we work together, we can work out something. Okay. Alright, I'm here to entertain you guys. Fuck all this other Star Wars bullshit! Going to Buck Rogers is played the fuck out, motherfucker. Ain't no fucking Buck Rogers, no fucking more. Get that faggot out of here. It's all about nigga getting, nigga eating. On the food on the table around this motherfucker. That's what it's about. Fuck all this Buck Rogers bullshit. It's all about motherfucker white my redneck with food on the table around this bitch. The fuck all the bullshit. And that's what the fuck going on here. And don't fucking forget, forget, forget it, that fucking shit. If they on some fucking Flash Gordon. Or the 21st century type shit. They fuck with shit. That's how many bugs on my mattress. Why the fuck I wanna know some monkey ass shit like that, dude? These white motherfuckers are Jews. They play Jews, man. So they bite up with that shit. Why the fuck I wanna know about these bugs on my motherfucking bed, dude? These niggas crazy, man. And that's what they dishing out to people on that fucking social media shit. And it's like, what the fuck is wrong with these crackheads, dude? How many donuts do we make in a factory for every year? What the fuck is this bullshit? That's gonna help me get food on my motherfucker? Knowing that? Nah, I like that kind of shit. To be honest with you, I love that kind of shit. I'm just making fun of it. It's very mind-blowing. They got all the views and subscribers, too, so... <laughs> they laughing at me going, look at you. Look at you, Dan Randall's nigga. You uh, sad nigga, Dan Randall's freak. Still calling me sad nigga. I ain't even a fucking a sad nigga. That's Indian fucking, you stupid bastard. My heritage is West Plain, dude. That's my culture. He telling somebody so damn saying it. It's fucking crazy. Dude, I swear to God. Or anybody y'all out there listening. 
You ain't supposed to be listening to this motherfucker, man. Hey, you know that. Hey, you know. That motherfucker said, hey, you know, hey, you know. They put a hole up in that nigga head. Biggie Smalls and fuck. He said, I don't want to. Ah, what the fuck am I talking about? What the fuck am I talking about? Let me shut up. Let me let me great go, guys. Cause I'm talking every time I talk stuff. Every time I talk stuff, stupid. I gotta go, y'all. It's time for me to go. So they're bogging the fuck out, dude. And I don't even give a motherfucker about it. The white man said, do what the fuck I tell you to do, or y'all get your fucking teeth knocked out. That's what the fuck he said. I ain't instigating no fights or nothing. I'm just saying. Anybody who ain't American listen to. You want me to say it again? I'm again on RVT, I'm not promoting no violence. All I'm saying is the white man said, do what the fuck he said, dude, or he's gonna knock your fucking head off. That's now that I'm not saying who I'm talking about. I ain't starting no fights, but I just want y'all to know that. That's all. So anyway, um, <laughs> y'all know I'm fucking around right now. Y'all know I'm fucking around. I don't want to start no trouble. Punk ass people in the world. <laughs> My she. The R man made me do it. <laughs> My G R man made me do it. <laughs> oh, punk ass Star Wars ass attitude shit. Mommy, close the basement door. Oh, punk ass fucking. What's the looking on the mat? What is that on the mat? Don't bring no trash, don't bring no shit up on this porch, sweetie. I mean it. I know she bring you something on the mat out, dude. This is like one of her bones I bought her. The end of it. <laughs> Mommy, my flower blew away. You want my sunshine? I'm gonna sing for y'all before I go. I have nothing to talk about because. I'm in the middle of something, guys. I can't talk to you serious about it because you wouldn't understand it. Alright? You wouldn't understand. Just trust me. I'm in the middle of the Rashid YouTube radio show coming up. And we're along with some other brand new things, guys. I got some mind-blowing things that's going to set me off. Set us off around here on the right way. And if y'all just be patient, y'all can just sit and enjoy it with me. I hope you can. You know, everybody sitting back listening and waiting for me to say something. Like I'm fucking Gandhi or fucking somebody. I ain't that fucking saying nigga dude. Tell y'all that right the fuck right off the bat. I don't give a fuck about him. Cause he's a stupid ass anyway, thinking he gonna get some damn pieces, some damn Indian. He fucking he was crazy from Jump Street. They should have kept, when they threw him off the train, the first incident, they should have ran on the fuck over. That's what they fucking shit did to his ass. He's a dumbass dog like Kennedy. A use, a somebody government used to fuck everything up. That's why we going through this bullshit. Now nah, y'all know I'm full of shit. Gandhi, my buddy, don't even fucking try that. Don't even try to Gandhi is my buddy. So, no, it's not that. It's just, I don't know. Guys, what y'all want to talk about? I don't give I don't give a fuck what it is. I can't talk to this business shit. I, I'm just not. I got some shit coming up. Y'all gotta fucking be patient. I got the YouTube radio show coming up. I'm sitting here bonging in front of you guys because, well, I don't give a shit. Bonging and fuck. And uh, I'm watching this nun movie or the damn they fucking nuns. And what are they doing? It's night. What year is it? 1978. Ah. <sighs> 
these movies like this, man. There's fucking movies like this. I know y'all missed hearing me, and I'm glad y'all like coming around, because I'm going to keep me entertained. There's never going to be no bullshit around this motherfucker, because I ain't going for that fucking shit. It's going to be all the time something to look at and enjoy. I'm going to try, I'm going to do my best. But you guys got to keep coming over and looking at my, uh, our station, Sadi, um, she could tears. We got to go shysting food shopping, so I'm under a lot of pressure. We're going to do that next week, and shysting food shopping is over. We'll get the Rashi YouTube video show. But you guys got to be patient. That's next week. That's why I'm putting this shit on now. Y'all got to fucking wait and be patient. I, I want to put shit up all the time. But I have other things, guys. This is the world. This right here on social media is just a ju it's just something I'm doing. I ain't, I ain't like that Jimmy faggot getting thousand dollar checks every time he do a show. Carson was like that, and Carson did. Check that out. Him and that fat fucking anime man talking that fucking shit. Oh! They both, they billionaires dead. He was, here. this motherfucker was trying to make you rich on Saturday morning with Hunt Publishers Clearhouse, and he fucking dead now. What was it all for? See how, fun, see how they did to his ass? They gonna remember him like that? That's part of his memory. That's some fucked up ass shit. It's just something on this line. So, what was I talking about? I branched out too far. I was talking about some shit. Guys, this is the time to realize who you are so you can be yourself. This is the time right now. No, no time like the present. Does you hear that saying? No time like the present. This is the time, and I'm letting you hear it. I'm no guru. I'm no leader. I'm none of that shit to you. Just an entertainer for you. I have all that someplace else. And I'm saying, as an entertainer, this is the time, guys, that we need to remember who we are. This is the time right here. These are the times of times right here. It starts right here. It starts right here, man. But you gotta really believe it. You know, you gotta really believe it. Nobody cares anymore. It will fall. We all carry on like this. Y'all can kiss sweet shit goodbye from head to fucking toe. And also, in this, if I start standing like, yeah, Y'all yeah, don't give a shit. I'll pick up and straighten out as long as you let it. Because I'm too close to this microphone. And I don't give a shit. I just don't. I tell people that. I really don't care. So just out of respect. Just to. You know it ain't no special effects or shit. I got a lot of things coming up. A lot of you guys I'm talking to, who listening to me, are wondering what's it all, what's going, what's it all about. And my response is, you tell me, play up. You tell me. I'm watching this movie. My eyes fixed on this movie a little bit. I gotta go shice the food shopping next week, so I gotta be careful what I buy. 
I got. I want to get that shit over with. Then I can put up some. It's just that time of year, guys. It's just everything matching up. It's not my fault. Y'all getting this? No fucking. You know. I got some shit. Y'all just gotta hang in there with me. We all stick together here. We all stick together around here. We don't get angry and shit. We all stick together. If you're getting angry, just remember, when you're not sticking together, man. That's, that's not who we are. Sticking together is without anger. We're going to have our periods when we get angry, but for the most part, we don't get angry around here. There's no reason to. We don't play that shit. So you got to be patient, man. Got to be patient. Is this lady fucking again on this damn? My dick moving again. I'm getting hard. She fucking. She fucking somebody in the rain. She fucking a guy in a wheelchair. Oh shit. You know what I wanna. You know who I wanna fuck. I wanna fuck a goth girl, baby. That's what I wanna fuck. I have before. But still, I'm just saying. A vamp goth or dark, you know. I say I know I have, but I'm just saying it. Damn. Let me shut up, man. Because see, y'all not feeling y'all. I say I want to fuck a goth girl. That's all the fuck I say. Okay. Well, okay. That's what I said. And I say I know I have. But I just said it. The, see, you just the weed getting to you. Nah, we didn't get to me. We getting to you. It ain't getting to me. You know, I'm just trying to tell you. You get something I said, and you come and underestimating, underestimating, whatever the fuck is the shit. The fuck. And I'm saying no. Because I'm saying I want to fuck a golf bitch. And that's the fucking. Well, okay. I had, well, there you go. Okay. There you go. There you the fuck over, man. All the gangsters dead, baby. All the gangsters dead. Every one of them. Ain't nobody trying to play tough over around here. All the gangsters dead. They ain't coming back. This ain't 1964. Ain't nothing but bitch up in this motherfucker now. Believe that. Everybody tough killed himself. They out of here. Ain't nothing but bitch up in here. Trust me. No computer geek ass shit every fucking way. Ain't nothing but straight bitch running shit now. So, it's like that. Guys. Let me tell you. I got a treat for you. I do. I have a treat for you. A treat for you. So outstanding. That it should have you in thought. For quite a bit of time. If y'all would just be patient and give me a little bit. Alright. I'm still here. I took you on a trip. We had fun and then now it's time to get back to the planet fucking earth dude. Okay. Everything's still cool. As far as the Jews concerned, any fucking way. No motherfuckers. <laughs> no motherfuckers admitting holidays and shit. So <laughs> Jews and men holiday. Everybody going to fuck crazy, dude. Everybody going crazy. 
<coughs> so stick around for some more stuff on RBT <laughs> and know that we hang out and we we chill out and you know you know and we rolling. Don't get upset. I ain't gonna wear it. I'll be around. Dang, okay, y'all know that shit. I'll be working. <laughs> she didn't kill the old man. She didn't kill the motherfucker. <laughs> it was not probably was hard as fuck. Killed his ass. So, um. Uh, let me take off, man, because I got some things that got to do. Rashid is always busy. Y'all stay close to RBT. It's part of RMJC. And you know I love having you here. Who gives a fuck about who is the fucker, dude? Ask yourself. Who is the fucker? All right. All right now. You know, when you go through hard times, I'm right there tapping your shoulder, laughing in your ear, dude. I'm laughing right with you on your shoulder when you out there in the world. You going through shit, my she right by your ear laughing. I'm saying, I'm just saying, see, see, monk the fuck up. Monk the fuck up, dude. All right, I'll talk to you soon. Take care. Can somebody give these girls some socks? Good girl. This program was brought to you by Rashid's Cyber Rock Films in conjunction with YouTube and Google Plus and social media plug out. It's all about change, real change. Peace. You're watching RVT Rashi's Teletube. Serving nations worldwide.
You're watching RVT, Rashid's Teletoon Worldwide. Where is Rashid all the time? You're watching Rashi's RVT. RVT, want to wish you a very happy shyston season. Oh, I feel so terrible. What's the matter, guy? Oh, you wouldn't understand. Oh, come on. It can't be all that bad. Okay, if I must, Rashid, I'll tell it to you. I have no sweets this year. You have no sweets? Well, that's not good. No, it's not good at all. I want something sugary. I want something delicious. Here, side dear. Try some chocolate bites. Chocolate bites? Yup, chocolate bites. Tiny chocolate bits wrapped up. After dinner or evening leisure. They're great. Hmm, chocolate bites. Hey, guy. Yeah? Are you feeling any better? Long as I got my chocolate bites. I know, I know. So, guys, when you're out, pick some up. It's great. You're watching RVT, Rashid's Teletoon Worldwide. Where is Rashid all the time? Still looking around the internet, still searching, find what you're looking for. My people always stop right here because this is where Sadisians live. RVT, Rashid's video too. Can you feel that? I'm sure you can. Where's the mouth, y'all? <coughs> In this great nation, people want to get entertained. And the entertainment that's available come from giant sources around the world. Giants amongst men. Yet and still, people love feeble acts. And that brings us to RBT. Now, here is a little different than what you usually expect the entertainment whatsoever. 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 There's no bullying here. And it's not likely that will happen on RBT. This is free speech. And I do like free speech. I like to talk. I like to express myself. So. You will not expect, don't expect this right here. Only on certain adverts. Here, I want to let you know that you rock. Here, I want you to relax. We use harsh and vulgar from time to we use harsh and vulgar from time to time. We use harsh vulgar here and again, but that's just who Rashi is. I, but I always make you smile. But even though we use harsh vulgar from time to time, we always get this. See, that's what matters. 
Now far as about far as all right, let's break let's break it down. Far as these guys go, I don't care. I don't care about all of this this this, this mayhem, this crap, this, this I don't care what they say about me. These guys, I don't care. I could care. I couldn't care. I don't care what they say about me. I don't care about what they say about me. They got they just do their thing, and that's the, I ain't got nothing to do with me. I don't care about it. here. I'm here to inspire you to open your mind for growth. I'm here to inspire you, and I understand. I understand, or at least let me understand. Help me to understand if I don't. See, here you are more than a tourist attraction, much more. There's no more dancing anymore here. There's no more, um, to be dancing is, is considered to be, I don't know, a bad thing now. All of a sudden, I don't know where this came from, but all of a sudden it's, it's your weak, it's a sign of being weak when you move your body now. See, I motivate you. Simply put, I motivate you and I will keep motivating always. And though the great leaders came and gone and faded from our memory as it were, we want everyone to know that the dream is still here. No more talking, no more reasoning, no more trying to figure out how we're going to do this or how we're going to do that, no more signing, no more uh, signatures, uh, uh, identification cards no more now it's time to just live period live we'll deal with the problems as they come if there are any problems here on RVT you are art pure art and I'm going to bring it out more and more and we're gonna all sit back and enjoy the haters, they keep on hating, they can keep on hating and hating, it's just making me more and more and more motivated to do what I'm doing. There's nothing like seeing pain come over someone who hates you because of who you are. That's what we're about. Because now it's time to see how it feels and here on RVT is where we're going to get our start let's keep it going guys good job Mommy, 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 mommy's taking me to the store. Oh, I'm so happy, I'm so happy, I'm so happy. Oh, mommy, mommy, mommy. Oh, go downstairs, gotta get dressed, gotta get dressed, go downstairs. Oh, I gotta get dressed, I gotta get dressed. Oh, it's such a beautiful day out here, mommy. It's such a beautiful day. Oh, my goodness, mommy, look at all the things, look at all the things. Oh, mommy, mommy, mommy. Oh, most of the things you get at the stores, you're gonna get really good deals if you got coupons. Oh, mommy, thanks. Hey guys, you know what this is? Come on, around here we call this the cure. What, you don't know what the cure is? Well first, let's talk about what this is. It's syrup. Now I know, I know, you use syrup for pancakes and waffles. But did you know there's other kinds of syrup? All from the finest things of the planet. Want strawberry pancakes? Let the curer do his job and transform your regular pancakes into strawberry ones. Okay, want blueberry pancakes? Go out and get blueberry syrup and voila! Blueberry pancakes. Use the flavors on ice cream, pie, and even cereal. No wonder why we call this the curer. 
It cures everything from plain to fabulous. So, enjoy nature's answer to plain. Look for money-saving coupons in the paper. You're watching RVT, home of Rashid's universe. And it is, too. We know Rashid. We know. On your RVT, Rashid's video too, serving nations worldwide. Rest, rest, play. Remember, any physical activity requires hours of rest. So be sure and get yours. Or if you need help with sleeping problems, just go to www.needhelptosleep.org. That's www.needhelptosleep.org. I am Gingerbread. Happy Shyson. Wishing you the very best this shison season here on RVT where it's Rashid all the time. RVT want to wish you a very happy shyston season. Up next on RVT, Rashid's Video Tube, the Rashid YouTube Radio Show. Keep one foot firm on the ground and the other one in happiness as we all celebrate shyst in this season. Here on RVT, where's Rashid all the time. 